What is going on guys, Corrosive Bullet? Welcome back to another Dragon Ball Legends summoning video. So we were kind of right in our last video that we put out, our prediction video. Uh, I did mention that we would probably, more than likely, be getting a new UST banner. Uh, and the UST units that would be on it would be uh, movies. Uh, however, I was not expecting it to be... Uh, revamped versions of Gogeta and Janemba. That that's that kind of came as a surprise. Um so Gogeta is green, which Fusions absolutely needs right now. Um Super Kamehameha attack plus 25 special uh move damage inflicted for five timer counts, which is pretty good. Um his main ability draws a special arts card. He restores his own key by 50, which is really good. Plus 100% on his next special move inflicted, which is really good too. Um, obviously, he's going to buff Fusion Warriors at Tag 2. Um, his special skill mobilizes the enemy, enemy 20% to damage inflicted for 10 timer counts. Reduces his next damage sustained by 25%. And he has Blast Armor with it too, which is kind of interesting. Um, his uniques applies the following effects to self once 40 timer counts have elapsed from battle start restores 50 health restores 20% health uh, plus 50% to damage inflicted uh, increases art card speed by one which is pretty good I think that's actually really really good um and then obviously his um he gets the uh, he gets uh, battle team members uh buffs as well so three battle members uh once he enters the battlefield 50% to blast damage and minus 5 to blast arts card only two members he gets the same blast damage inflicted minus 7 and then if there's one it's minus 7 strike and blast so so, all around, he's a very solid unit. He's very solid. Like I said, he's exactly what Fusion's needed. Janemba, on the other hand, uh, <laughs> a lot of people have been kind of saying that he's going to he's gonna best uh, Yellow Movies Gohan. Um, and that he's like a replacement for Kid Buu. Uh, I don't think that's going to be the case. I think he... I, I think... I don't think it's nece he's necess necessarily going to put... Yellow Gohan away. I don't think he's going to shut him down in any way, but I think he's going to really, really, really spice up the meta a little bit with it. You'll pr we'll probably see less Yellow Gohans, but we won't we won't see the eradication of Yellow Gohan. Yellow Gohan's just too good to uh, to get rid of. So if anything, this just gives him an extra hurdle. Excuse me. Um. All right, so deals massive slice damage for a special move, hundred percent chance to inflict heavy bleed, which is to kind of be expected. Um, draw a special arts card on his main ability, plus thirty five percent to strike damage inflicted for thirty timer counts, minus ten to own strike arts counts for thirty timer counts, which is pretty good. Um, special skill. Counter will activate upon enemy blast arts or tap shot attack when this attack when this character is charging forward with his special skill. Um, he immobilizes the enemy, plus seventy five to the next strike arts special arts damage inflicted, which is pretty decent. And if the enemy is a saga for the movie, you destroy all their enemy cards. Okay. So yeah, so essentially that would kind of render. Uh, Yellow Gohan a little useless when he can't even do anything. He wouldn't be able to do anything until he uh, draws more cards. So that's actually pretty decent. 28% uh, to tag regen. Strike attack. I figured as much for that. Uh, I think it, I think the old Janemba was a strike based unit. So I kind of assumed he was going to be strike based as well. Uh, applies the following effects to self when this character enters the battlefield. Restores key by 30. Plus 40 to damage inflicted for 50 ti 15 timer counts. Gradually restores own health each timer count for uh, for 30 timer counts. That's pretty good. Uh, and then 
thirty percent to all to damage inflicted against any, uh, episodes, sagas from the movies. Reduces damage received from episode sagas by twenty. So those are just sustained buffs. That's where that's where regen kind of comes into play against the movie saga, or at least this character anyway. It's pretty good. Uh, while this character is on the battlefield, the following effects occur every time the enemy uses a special arts card. Plus 20% to damage inflicted for 15 timer counts. Reduces enemy key by 30. That's... Janemba's actually really good. I honestly think between all both these characters, Janemba's probably the one to pull for. Just because his kit is a bit w more well-established and actually... And whatnot, but there's nothing wrong with getting Gogeta either. Good, like I said, good uh, fusions need a green. Uh, so anyway, yeah, let's just jump right into it. So I got five multis we can go for, and I have my guaranteed ticket that we can go for as well. So let's just jump right on in. Now I would like to get a Gogeta because I don't have Super Vegito, so I would like anything to kind of buff fusions personally. But that's just me. All right, we're getting an EX, I think. Oh, Vegeta, maybe? No, we. I think we're. I think we might get an EX in this. So while I've been away, I've actually been working on uh, getting the OG Red Goku to Zenkai Awaken. Uh, I think I'm only a couple steps away from doing it, if not one more step. Ah, uh, we didn't. We, yep, we got one EX. That was all we got from that. Um, but yeah, uh, that's what I've been kind of working on. That's why I've been uh, kind of away for the past couple days. So expect to see a video on Zenkai Awaken Goku uh, in the next uh, day or two, maybe three. All right. There's also no face cam in this video today, guys, because it's early in the morning. I just woke up. I don't look great. <laughs> okay, come on. Come on. See, I feel like this is what I feel like this is exactly what happened. Uh. I feel like this is exactly what happened uh, with the uh, transforming freezer and cooler. It took me so many summons to even try and get. Wait a minute. Oh, I, I was gonna say I didn't. I didn't get Android. Uh, I didn't get fourteen or fifteen. Man, I feel like I'm getting. Yeah, I feel like I'm getting cheated again. <laughs> Okay, gut punch. Small text. It's a possible fake out. Maybe. Come on. Ah, uh, we got a Janemba. <laughs> oh man! Oh my God! We're not gonna get uh, we're not gonna get any of the new characters. <laughs> that's that's kind of nuts. Unless this fakes out. <laughs> no, I feel like I'm going to skip. I feel like this is not going to be anything. Yeah, it wasn't anything. All right, last multi. This is a very, very underwhelming video, guys. This is very underwhelming. <laughs> we 
didn't get anything from that. The GT banners were too good to me, I guess. The GT banners were too good to me. We got that super Janemba again. Uh, well, we can only hope for our ticket at this point. Yep. Uh, that's depressing. Okay. All right, well, we got our daily, so we'll do our daily. <laughs> One pod. Uh, I was gonna skip it. Yeah. Oh, it's a fake out. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Imagine, imagine going through and doing five multis and not getting a single character. And yet you pull them on the daily. <laughs> awesome. I, all right. We got one of them. I can't be mad. I can't be mad about that. All right. Ticket summon. Five pods. Okay. Well, before we... To end out on this video. End out on this video, guys. Um... For this week, expect to see a uh, expect to see a <laughs> Fusion Android thirteen. I don't have him yet. Interesting enough, so I'll I guess I'll take it. I'll take it. Um, so for later this week, uh, Kakarot comes out on Thursday night. Uh, I will be coming home. I will be doing an unboxing uh video uh on the collector's edition. So you will see a collector's edition uh, unboxing for that. Um, and then immediately after that, we're going to be streaming Kakarot for a little bit. Uh, future episode or uh, well, uh, Kakarot, the playthrough on, that we do on our Twitch stream will be going up on YouTube here uh, as we uh, as we kind of play through it. So uh, expect to see that down the road. And then again, uh, once we get Zenkai uh, Goku, I will upload a video on that just kind of going over the highlights of what he's able to do at Zenkai level one uh no decision yet as to what no decision yet as to uh if I'm going to try to go seven with him I don't think I'm going to just because it's a that that's a very big pay to win uh or pay to play mechanic and I don't think I don't think anyone should really spend their money on it but I went through the grind at the very least to get level one so I'll show you guys what Zenkai level one Goku is able to do at some point. So uh, look out for all that stuff later on this week. And with that said, guys, thank you guys for stopping in for the summoning video today. I will see you guys in the next one. Take, take care. Bye-bye.